We have a number of concerns across the nation as we look at the weather map heading through the weekend. It's all associated with a few systems, uh, one coming onshore in the Pacific and another one that is moving across the central U.S. It's this first system uh, that is moving across the central U.S. here that is going to be bringing some thunderstorm activity to parts of the plains and some ice and snow to locations to the north. So looking at the forecast, we'll see this system continue to track eastward through the weekend. And then this system in the Pacific moving on shore, bringing an abundance of moisture in the form of coastal rain and mountain snow to the Pacific Northwest. First off, the expected snow. This is all the way through the end of the day on Monday. Chicago in line for around five to nine inches of accumulated snow. And then as the system moves eastward, we'll start to see that accumulated snow in parts of uh, the northeast as well. But along with that, we're also going to see some icing, and that's what makes it uh, especially difficult across portions of the Midwest. So for parts of uh, the Dakotas, Minnesota, and into Iowa, some freezing drizzle in the mix in there as well. So the National Weather Service has a number of uh, winter weather advisories, winter storm warnings for the pink shaded areas. That's where some of the heavier snow will be occurring. Meanwhile, to the south, it's windy. 50 mile an hour wind gusts possible across parts of Texas, as well as some strong thunderstorms in those dark green shaded areas.